Had a chance to stop in Oxford, Mississippi this morning. Did some street performing, some busking on the sidewalk, and I went and checked out, found some live music. I had a good time and the people were nice. So I pulled in uh, Oxford. I pulled in and I thought they had a really cool like town center, a little cool square. And I'll be honest, I came out from Memphis, I've been hanging out in Memphis, and I just really wasn't getting the busking vibes there, so I didn't do it too much, and um, kind of had to, to bring back my enthusiasm. But I liked it here in Oxford, so I, I came upon, I was just walking around, checking it out, looked at some bookstores, and then um, came upon Rooster's Blues House, and I got a Bloody Mary before noon, so I had some alcohol, and uh, other people were drinking. It was really nice, they had a band playing. <laughs> The, the, they were really good. They were really funny though. They really emphasized who was related to who. They had to point out all the, the relationships among the people on the stage and the people in the crowd and things like that. Who was married and not. It's really funny. One of the guys at the bar, I heard him talking about how his wife made him a big breakfast. And the bartender, he was a young guy, you know, just like 18 or something. He's like, oh, I'm jealous. He's like, oh, you got time, you got plenty of time. The family, the relationship, the marriage thing seemed pretty strong um, in that town. I thought, it, I just thought it was funny. Good for them. Do it. Keep that healthy family going. I was feeling good about uh, going and playing on the street. We take the information and we're tempted by temptation and we're electing our tribes. We're sticking around. Some people won't, but they can't have. Some people want to burn it down. Police officer gave me a dollar. I was worried because he was walking by, and I was like, "Oh, is this finally the time where somebody tells me to stop playing?" But instead, he gave me gave me a buck. That was nice. Uh, people looked at me. They smiled. I had a good time. I felt felt like Oxford's a cool place. This is the town where uh, William Faulkner's childhood, and then he, um, he lived there, William Faulkner, the writer. And it's a home of the University of Mississippi, Ole Miss. So I had a good time here. I hope to come back and check out some music in more extent when I'm not so hurried. I'm heading to Tupelo, birthplace of Elvis Presley, hoping to see the Elvis Presley house. This is a Sunday. I was busking around 1 p.m. It was pretty hot. A little bit, not too much foot traffic. It was all right. But um, I could tell they have a, a good music scene in Oxford. So I'm on my way. Thanks for checking this out. Thanks for tuning in. Uh, if you like to hear about my adventures of playing music, my own music, my psychological sort of thoughts that I share, hit the subscribe button and the bell button for notifications. Hit the share. And the like, if you share and like, leave your comments below on what you think, if you could recommend any other cities to busk in or places. And um, I got a bunch of links to below to my website and other social media and things like that. So thanks for tuning in.